as seen on TV. And it's one of those programs where you see the infomercials, or you see them out and about, and we either bring them in first or we give you the best deal anywhere on those as seen on TV items. Well, that's exactly what our first item is. It's actually the best of both worlds. It's brand new and it's an awesome, awesome configuration. But let me tell you what's coming up at midnight tonight. Ready? Oh, what happens when like your team scores, right? You go, yes! What happens when you're mad? You go, oh, right? You raise your hands. Well, we're so excited because late night TV host, we all know him, Jimmy Fallon, teamed up with Carl Banks and G3 and have created what's called Hands High. So you literally team your logo. When you raise and you scream and you want to show it off, you're going to see the logo. It's exposed. It's so cool. It's our only hoodie today special of the entire year. We'll launch it at midnight. By the way, go to HSN and my Facebook page. I'm going to do shout outs. So brag about your team. Dog me out. A lot of people do. We have a great time and it all launches at midnight at the football fan shop so we'll talk about this in just a few it is a phenomenal uh, hoodie and it's an awesome deal okay speaking of awesome deals and a really smart aha product like it's one of those she goes why did i think of that okay so you know, you're driving in a car and you got all this stuff in the middle where you know you get the little console and it's so crowded and there's never enough room and you're like gosh how can I make that little sliver of space that usually stuff gets lost in? How can I make it smarter? How can I make it more productive? Well, look how clever this is. It's called the Car Valet. It's a brand new launch today. I've only got a couple thousand going into tonight's show. You get a set of two, and then you get the microfiber cloth. So that little sliver that you always lose stuff in now becomes productive. How brilliant is that? All right, we're gonna tell you all about it. I'm gonna introduce you to Carrie, who joins me. Hi, Miss Carrie. Oh my gosh, Carrie's hi. One of, Carrie's one of our gadget girls. She brings us all this clever stuff for our home and this is kind of one of those aha uh -huh you know I was saying earlier today because we we launched this this morning and one of the things that I said was god why didn't I think of that mm -hmm. because I'm you know I'm a mom I've got four boys I'm a woman I like to have my cell phone close by I want to have my lipstick close by so where am I going to put my drinks when I finally get to the drive through and I'm like oh gosh and you know here boys take this and so when I found this product I thought to myself this is it right here. I think we can all kind of relate to this little configuration here. We've got <laughs> trash and pens and pencils. It's a mess. What if I told you that you can, you know, you can keep it like this if you want, but I can give you usable space in this great system. So what you're going to get is two of the car valets and two of the microfiber cloths. The reason we're including the microfiber cloths is because, first of all, we know that they're the best thing best to clean. Best cloth on Anything, the face of the earth. But they're really great for cleaning these. However, since it's completely portable, you can pull it right out and rinse it off. And it's super easy Which to I use. Which I think that's huge. Yes. How's your cup holder right now? Like, does it have crumbs and stuff? And you can't get it out to actually clean it, and it's so disgusting. How awesome is this? You literally pull it out. You can rinse it out. You can just wipe it out. And now you just slip it back in. I think this is such a brilliant idea, too, because it takes space and really maximizes it. And what happens to that little sliver? We only lose stuff. I, I call that the, the, you know, the black hole of the car. Something drops in you. You look and go, I will never ever get what's down there. This not only holds and covers that up, but now it's a smart space solution. And again, great gift idea, right? Mm. If you've got somebody hard to buy it for, and I definitely am thinking early Christmas shopping, because it's actually not very far away. It's like, I think we're at like 79 days or 82 oh. days. I know, I know. <laughs> so think about this, because we have them in stock, first launch today, and just a really clever idea. Also too, Carrie, a lot of people don't have this in the middle of the console. True, true. It's not very functional. It's just kind of a solid engine part with nothing. So this is handy if you don't have any cup holders whatsoever. Very true. And you know, this is completely exclusive to HSN, this configuration where you get two of them and the microfiber cloths. And this is the best value on the market for it. So if you don't mind, I'm going to take you over to our car, sure, our car situation down. over here. And let me show you how easy this is to use. Again, you can choose whether or not you want to put it on your side. But you know what I have found? I like to put it on the passenger side. So I'm gonna show you here oh, my buddy John. Idea. Yeah, you know, because, yeah. I mean, listen, it's not gonna get in the way of anything, but it's really easy. I want you guys to see that right here, you've got this thin sliver here. And where you're gonna do, what you're gonna do is you're gonna slide it down into this black hole, as you call it, which I love. I can make a full meal out of what I can drop down, down there. <laughs> and you're just gonna simply slide it in. It fits all cars, all SUVs, all vans, okay. and now I can put anything that I might possibly need in here. Now, 
not only can you use it for your cups, but we also have a little space in here that you can put your cell phone. It's not going to impend your space. Is impend a word? Impede. Impede. Yeah. It's not going to impede your space. I'm trying to be honest, okay? It's late. It's good, 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 good. <laughs> so it's not going to impede your space at all. But if you want to hook your phone through here, it even has a little space That's to put your clever. cord. Because the cord's always all over the place. All it's over the just place. everywhere. Yep. Right. And so That's again, really it's really easy to get in and out. And now I can still keep whatever I need in this space and know that at any time I can take it in or out one step, I can still strap my seatbelt in, and it's really, really great. Now listen, it's made in the United States. Oh, nice. It's also antimicrobial, so this is going to fight any kind of gunk and blah, blah, blah. Nobody wants to go in here, okay? If I'm gonna be honest with you, there are really scary things in here. There's <laughs> sticky coins and like old right. cough drops. So I like to just keep things really close to me and know that they're gonna be nice and clean. And I think that's such a great idea if you spend a lot of your time and, and you put it, to, and you let's say, like for me, I drive in a lot without anybody in the passenger seat. This is awesome just to slip one of them on the opposite side. So it just gives you all that much more working space. I have a dear, dear friend of mine, Lori. She's uh, on the road sales rep. I mean, she goes and she's on the road all the time. Any more organization she can get in the front of her car with all of her phones and everything she has to do, that's kind of a perfect idea for somebody like that. Also, too, this is what I love. You're about to see another feature I think is brilliant. You ready? Okay, how many of you do not have like a coffee table, table handy on either side of your couch? Or there's, you know, someone's sitting on the couch with you and there's nothing, no place for them to put stuff down. We're talking football at midnight tonight. If you have any football fanatics, Get this set for them, because I want you to show yes. the couch. Now, this is where my aha moment came in. I was like, okay, this is great. So you got the gang all over. Yeah. You got everybody packed on the couch. Somebody in the middle does not have a place to put their drinks or whatever, their goodies. And listen, so I love this Again, feature. being a mom, and I have like four rambunctious boys. I love you. You guys are great. But listen, <laughs> I knew that somebody was going to smash their head on a table. Maybe you don't have space for it, but they still want to have their drinks and stuff. Right. Check this out. By the way, you're going to get two of them. Keep one in your car and put one one right okay. in your sofa. Hello, oh, the beer, the yes. football game. Hey, We're all happy. The remote. <laughs> the remote. Oh, I mean, a great idea. I don't want to reach in here. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't want to get in there. But I do love that this is going to be nice and secure so you and I can get up and down as many times as we want and this is totally secure. I yeah. love it. And it's really neat too because there's actually a wedge system in the back. That's why it's staying in there really tight, nice and tight. It actually basically wedges in. Is that not smart? So do you have anybody as the man cave? I'm all about NFL football tonight, right? Because it's coming up at midnight. Don't you love this new hoodie? I love it. Oh. Yes. Isn't it smart? <laughs> anyway, it's called hands high. But you know, if you have you have a bunch of people on the couch, there's three of us. Mm -hmm. I might have something here, but there's nothing there. And maybe say, you know what? Reaching it's in the recliner. And yes. Yeah, but how about the recliner? You're all laid back and you're watching the game and you don't have to hardly move. You're just like, oh, it's right here. <laughs> <laughs> this I is the epitome for those who like to chill, right, during the oh, game. Totally. And you know, you do have this kind of tiered system inside of it where it can fit something really small in here and then maybe something a little bit bigger. And for me, I love coffee. I, I love coffee in the morning and I take my boys over to the carpool in the morning. I don't want to take my coffee and dump it into one of my carriers. I like to put my actual coffee mug inside of this and know that it's going to fit in there because this is a really nice big size. And again, totally portable. Just like this, it slides in. It's one step. And because I can pull it out, and rinse it, I don't have to worry about this accumulating that gook. And by the way, you guys, two of these microfiber cloths, I mean, really, a deal that you can't beat. I well, love it. And, and, I, and honestly, microfiber cloths are great for cleaning anything, but they're especially good in your car. You know what I mean? And it's for the windshield. You know, your windshield gets so messy and you can't, you stop at a, like a light and the sun's shining through and you're like, Oh, and then you're whoa. looking around for a napkin from like the drive through <laughs> to try to clean it off. If you have a microfiber cloth, it just cleans it off beautifully. So just leave these in the car. You know, also think about splitting it up. I mean, I'm all about clever gifts. I really am, especially when it comes to shopping for like guys in your life because it's hard to buy for them, right? So think about getting, you get two of these plus two cloths. You put it in. I tuck this away and I would make it as that extra gift for Christmas. You know how you get them like a bigger gift or you want to give multiple gifts? How fun would this be? Also, if you do a gift exchange, look at all these ideas I have. I know. I just think it's hilariously fun and smart. Like at first glance, they go, what? And then when they start using it, you're like, oh, oh, now, uh, now I get it. And again, let's go. You want to go back over to the car? Sure, yeah, absolutely. Because this is, to me, this is where I have gotten the most use out of it for 
me in my life, again, because I like to have my stuff right at my fingertips. I like to know that I've got my cell phone right here and gum. You know, I like to keep all of this stuff here, but chances are pretty good that at some point I'm gonna bring a bottle of water with me. Sure. I'm gonna stop at my local coffee place and I'm gonna wanna find a place. I don't wanna lose this space, but I love knowing that I now have this great little tool. I can slide it right in here and now I have extra space for everything. Okay. Awesome. And I'll tell you what, it actually does not take up a lot of seat space. That's what mm. surprised me. I thought, oh, I'm not gonna be, this is, a, this is a standard car seat, right? And I thought, oh, you know, if I had something kind of in here, it would bug me. Absolutely doesn't. And also, oh, no. if you have a little armresty thing, you pop the armrest up and it's very comfortable. It's not like you're going, oh, you know, it's in the way. And again, to each their own. Maybe it would make you uncomfortable to have something here. Number one, you'll get used to it very quickly. And I know that because I did. It's gonna fit all cars, all SUVs, all vans. But if you feel like maybe I don't want something so close, trust me you do, but if you don't, toss it over here. It goes on both there sides. You know. Like, let them deal with it, right? You right, know what I mean? Right. Or if no one, like I said, I spend most of the time in my car just driving around by myself. So it's gonna be really handy just to have that over there to give me that extra real estate. Which is really, think about it as that weird spot in your car that's usually a black hole, and now it cleverly does something with it. You know, if you lose something down there, and just not to lose junk down in that hole anymore would be a really nice thing. <laughs> How many times have you used the cord of your phone to like save the phone itself, and I'm pulling it up, and and then yep. it pulls itself off because it gets trapped in yeah, there. Yeah, it's down in there, yeah, down so in the it, hole. Ironically enough, I have enjoyed having this extra space here, but there is something to be said for not having to deal with things falling down there. I and it's, totally we agree. all are trying to maximize our space and maximize our time. And if you can avoid having to clean all this stuff out in a pressed for time moment, sure, yeah. like running through the drive-thru or grabbing coffee or your kids are, I can't tell you just how many times. Organized. Yeah, just to be and, organized. And also too, there's the hole. So if you've got a mug or if you have one of those tumblers that has a big handle on it, it's gonna fit right in there. They thought of everything actually on this. Yes. See that right there? <laughs> all right, so here's what we have left. I've only got a couple thousand remaining and then it's sold out. Don't forget, we've got Plex on this. That is what, $8.98 to try it out. And if you're going to do a holiday gift, we're in our extended return policy. You have until the end of January to return this if you don't love it. Thank you, Carrie. My pleasure. All Thank right, you. Coming up in just a moment. Stay with us. Yeah, this is a huge customer pick. And, you know, I think tonight it's kind of a sobering reminder that we really do need to be prepared for emergencies. And it could be anything. You know, it could be along the road, just being able to see better. Or it could be something fun like camping or uh, maybe you're out and about walking the dog. We have from Bella and how the set of four torch light nano LED flashlights. These are so clever, super powerful, great for that dark closet. You just hang it in there when you need it. Great if you just need extra uh, space or, um, excuse me, extra light. But also important when you have, say, a flat tire or an emergency, you've got light when you need it. And it's very powerful and a huge set of four. So those are coming up. We'll talk about those just around the corner. And that is an exclusive configuration. All right, at midnight, well, I have to tell you, Jimmy Fallon, we all know him. He's that awesome awesome late night TV star. He had this brilliant idea of, hey, wait a minute. When everybody, when they score a touchdown or you're at the game or you're at home and you raise your arms in excitement to cheer, you're like, woohoo, this is awesome. And he thought, why not make a line of clothing that celebrates when you raise your hands up? And this is called hands high. So you're like, yay team. And how cool is that? You don't see it until you raise your hands up to cheer. Isn't that awesome? This is coming up. So Jimmy Fallon worked with Carl Banks and G3 made our only, only hoodie of the entire year. This, by the way, completely exclusive. It will never be, because I know Jimmy's very successful with the line, you'll never see this in any store out there, any sports store whatsoever. This is coming up. It's going to be a huge launch at midnight. So you ready to get your game on? Come on, let's do it. And you're going to see that. Can you tell I was a cheerleader? Yes, go team. Anyway, <laughs> all cheerleaders should wear this as well. But anyway, that's going to be coming up at midnight tonight. All right, but before we do that, we have one of my favorite products in the world on. Now, I am a huge customer here at HSN, probably too big of one, I should be careful, but I do a lot of different crafts and hobbies and just things around the house. And uh, we had my favorite little cuppy from my son who's now 19, it's a VeggieTales plastic cup. And that darn thing broke and I was ready to cry because it's all worn, I know it's so cute. So I got out the laser bond and my husband looked at it and said, 
and my husband's a real skeptic. He's like, what is that? That's not gonna work. And I go, no, no, really watch. And it's the first time I'd used it. And I used it along the crack and we were able to rebuild this cuppy. And it holds water and it's still usable. And that was brilliant. Then I lost a knob in my bathroom. So I went, well, I must as well try laser bond, what the heck? So I did it and I put it on and oh my gosh, the knob stuck instantly and stayed put. And that's just the beginning of the brilliance of Laser Bond. And we've got another exclusive configuration here at HSN. You get a set of two. We've sold over 67,000 since we launched it in March. And we have two flex tonight and free shipping. Lou Caputo. Hello. I'm sure you have many more stories than that. You've heard. I do. But those are my two. Those are good stories, yeah, though. They are, They're right? very good stories. Well, the, the thing about Laser Bond is that it's not a glue. It's right. not an adhesive. It won't dry in the air. This is what it is. You get this tube, you get two of these tubes, and you get a carrying case when you get these home. Now, the laser bond is inside of this. You take this little end off here, and there's a precision applicator tip right there, okay? So you just use a very little tiny bit, and then you actually use ultraviolet light to harden it, and it turns into a hard plastic. So it's a liquid resin that turns into a hard plastic. Take a look at this. Now, I've got this little piece of plexiglass down here, okay? And I always like to show people how, once I put this, I, you can see I've done it a couple times around here. I'm gonna put a little dot of it right here, okay? A little dot of laser bond. You can see it's liquid right there. And I can move this around, and I can play with it as long as I want to, as long as I don't hit it with the UV light. So all day long it'll sit there, unlike your glues that dry in the tube. Watch this. Hit it with that UV light, though, and count to three to five seconds. One, two, three, just like that. And that's hard, okay? Just like that, that quickly, that's already hardened. And the nice thing about it is it dries perfectly clear. So you can use this on any color surface. It doesn't matter, that's okay? Right. And my knob is yes. a clear knob. Oh, is it? So it had to be clear. Perfect. And if I would put a, a glue or a sticky putty thing, well, you'd absolutely see it. Oh, no, totally. And, and it would be all weird and bumpy, which yeah. nobody likes, right? So if I, let's say, for instance, I wanted to put a hook on a mirror. Maybe I want to hang uh, a loofah or something, you know, or, you know, whatever. You want to hang something on a piece of glass. Watch what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a little bit of laser bond. I'm just going to give it a little little line like that down the back. That's all, you don't have to use a whole bunch. I'm gonna put this down, I'm gonna kinda smoosh it around a little bit to spread it out, and then I'm just gonna hit it with the laser light. Now, have you ever been to the dentist the last couple years and noticed that when they do your fillings, they put that light in your mouth? Yep. It's the same thing. They use this resin that they put in there, and then they use the UV light to harden it. And what, if you notice what I'm doing is I'm just going along here and just making sure that I give, you know, three to five seconds in every little piece that I put on here. Just wanna double check, make sure we're done. Notice I'm doing it through the plastic, too. Yeah, I'm going right through cool. the plastic, yeah. watch this. I'm gonna pick it up just like that, okay? So now, if that were a glue, we'd still be all sitting here waiting. You know, the show's not long enough, really, for a piece of glue to dry. But that quickly, I can do it with the laser bond. And that's what's amazing about it, is that you can make repairs almost instantly. Okay, so in that instance, yes. and the first one you showed us with the demo, mm -hmm. it's all clear, but you can really use it on lots of material. Lots of material. For instance, here's a plastic football, okay? Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this pin, and I'm gonna punch a hole right into the back of this here. There's, look at that, we've done, done this a couple times now, as you can see. But I'm gonna take this, and I'm just gonna punch a hole right there in the back, okay? And to prove to you that th there's a hole there, I'm gonna go over to this glass, uh, bowl of water. I'm gonna put it in here, watch this, I'm gonna squeeze it. See the bubbles? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're getting bubbles coming out of there. I'm gonna dry it off just like this. And this is what's so cool about this stuff is how quickly it works. Now that it's dry, I'm gonna take my laser bond and we're gonna figure out, I think the hole was over here. Yeah, I think so. All right, I'm gonna put a little bit of laser bond right there. The nice thing is that it dries so fast that I could, if I did make a mistake, I could fix it. Look at oh, that. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, just like that. We put it on there, and I'm gonna put it back in the water, give it a little squeeze, and nothing's coming no out of it. No holes. So that quickly it worked. And this is a rubber ball. It's got a textured surface, you know, and we just fixed that in a couple seconds. And that's just one of the many things that you can do with your laser bond. Um, here's another great one, too. And this is one, you know, this time of year, of course, um, you know, we're coming out of the summer, but it's going to be that time of year again where you're going to want to, like, use your screens. Look at that. There's a nice big hole in that right there. Now, you can buy those big patch kits and they charge a lot of money. You can hire somebody to come out and put a whole new screen in. Me being cheap, though, what I like to do is I like to take my laser bond just like this. Just put a nice little dab of it on there and watch this, because really, we're, we're this is what I call an air gap. It's missing a piece right there. So I'm actually drying the two sides together. I'm attaching them. And again, if you were trying to do this with glue, you'd be here for a very long time. And in just a couple seconds, just by doing that, we have fixed that hole. My finger will not go through there now. You know, so, I have a dear friend of mine, too, her yes. name's Robin, and she is a multimedia artist. And mm -hmm. she works on, with everything, plastic and all this crazy material. And I right. showed her the laser bond, and I said, oh, this is the perfect 
perfect item for you because she she attaches weird stuff to other weird stuff. Oh yeah. And it's all different materials, and she's fallen in love with it because she always used a hot glue gun. And what would happen is she'd make something, but eventually it would start to fall apart yeah. if you moved it or touched it, and the glue would just get dry or whatever. Then she switched to this, and now she gets that super strong bond. So yeah. I'm not saying you have to be an artist to use it, but she's kind of the one who's experimented oh, the yeah. most in my life with different materials attaching to it. Well, it's funny you say that though, because look at this mirror I'm about to do here. You can see that he tried to attach these stones with glue, right? And it did dry and it did fall off. Okay, but watch if I take the laser bond, and this was what's kind of neat about. And now, by the way, my wife Kelly is a crafter too now, yeah. and she goes crazy for this because she likes to work in mediums like glass. Okay, right. mm -hmm. watch this. I'm gonna go actually go underneath it like this, right around the edge here, and that the light is actually getting underneath there. You can see it going underneath on the mirror, and just give it a couple seconds. But again, if I had wanted to move that, if I wanted to position it somewhat differently, okay, I could because I have time. Now watch this. Isn't that great? Done, just like that. So if you're a crafter and you're doing a whole project, you wanna move kinda quickly, right. this is gonna allow you to move quickly. How about this? This is a remote from a car, okay? okay? These things cost a lot of money. This one is actually got a piece of plastic that's broken. I mean, it's gone. You can see that there's a hole right there. The glue's not gonna fix that. You can't push those two pieces together. No. With the laser bond, though, I can take the laser bond, put it right inside that gap there. Might not be the neatest thing in the world I just did, but watch this. Just like that, in just three seconds, it's done. <laughs> that's fixed already. So now you can put this back on your keychain, nothing's gonna fall off of there. Right. And that just saved you maybe $100, $200, depending on what kind of car you're driving. What are the other surfaces it works on? Uh, it'll work on glass, it'll work on plastic. You know what, let's go down here. Oh, because we have a whole table full of things to show you. For instance, here it is attaching glass to metal, okay? okay. Here we are attaching ribbons and um, sequins to glass over here. Here we fixed a pair of glasses, plastic to plastic right See, there. See, I think that's a brilliant Isn't that neat? idea. Yeah. yeah, we just fixed, oh, because a piece was missing again. So what I did is I actually just joined the two pieces together by making my own little piece right there. Um, here's a, a rubber hose that broke, okay? We filled the rubber hose and then I put it all the way around so that it would stand the pressure. The one thing people always ask me about is can I use it on shoes, can I use it on leather? Take a look at this. Right here is a leather handbag and I always have to look at it and see, right there. That's where we fixed it. Oh and then, man, and that's that cool? brilliant. And you know, you know, leather, with leather it absorbs anything you put on it. Right. This is not gonna absorb it, okay? So it makes, it actually makes a little hard piece of plastic. Um, here we fixed a flip flop and just put that little grommet on the bottom right there. That's not actually part of the shoe. We put it on there and look, it works. It's oh, not gonna great. go out of there. And the last thing right here for the kids, if you got the kids down by the pool, right here, this mask broke, look at that. Yeah. We actually put those two pieces together again. That's smart. Yeah, so all these materials. I mean, think about all the, and, and again, you'll get to one of those things where my aha moment was the little cup that broke the mug. Yeah. So if you've got a favorite mug or a favorite pottery piece and you're like, oh my gosh, you know, somebody knocked it over and broke it, mm -hmm. you'll really, you know, we run for just all those other glues and they yeah. really don't work nope. and they're messy and they smell. This one is so easy and it's so fast. The other option might be, hey, you've got something at home that's fallen off, mm -hmm. like my little knob did. I just reached for it and went, wow, it worked again. Yeah. Um, so you'll find just having it in your drawer in the kitchen when those emergencies happen and you go, oh, you know what, Where's, where is that? And then yeah. you go use it and you'll go, oh, you kind of marvel at how clever it is. Well, and uh, beyond clever, because it's not just for making repairs, it's for actually making things. For instance, now kids are back in school, everybody's got those backpacks, we all got these buckles on them, right? If a piece breaks off, one of these little pieces right here breaks off, you know what? You're never gonna be able to close that backpack. You're gonna have to buy a whole new one. Watch this. I took it, I pushed it into a piece of clay and made a mold. Huh. I filled the mold with laser bond and I made an exact replica of the piece that broke off. You see that right there? So if I needed to replace that piece, I could, and all I did was just fill that with laser bond over and over again and harden it, and you can build on it and just great? make things. It yeah. fabricates, I love that about this. What are some of the uh, ideas that people have sent you that you went, oh, now that's really clever. Kids' toys are huge. Let me, oh, let me, right. let me just that's tell you That's a something. great one, Kids' yeah. toys are huge. People are fixing kids' <laughs> toys like crazy. Jewelry, that's another one that we get a lot of people saying, oh, you know what, I use this on a piece of jewelry. Because you know, for costume jewelry, you find a piece, you love it, you're about to wear it and go out and you go to pick it up and it breaks. Right. Okay. Now, instead of having this repaired, and frankly, may not have spent enough money on it, you know, to, to want to do, I'm sorry guys, I didn't, I'm trying to make that a little easier. We're going to stick this in here, just like this, and watch this. This is the toughest part, is lining it up like this. You just drop it in here, something like that. <laughs> I'm going to get it eventually, Suzanne, you know I will. I know. Oh, good Lord. You're very determined. I'm very determined. There. Oh, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> it got stuck so on close, my head. So close. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Well, I would say too, you know what happens to me, what? especially on some of my faux jewelry, I'll lose a there stone. Okay. Like I'll just, the stone will pop out and I'll see the stone, but then you don't know how to get it to secure it back in. Yeah. So especially on fashion jewelry pieces, you know? Yeah, it's wonderful for that. Watch this. So I hit it with that. 
Now, hopefully I got that in there because you really do have to have the two pieces at least touching each other. Sure. All right, so there, a couple seconds. Remember, I put a whole glob on there right now, but watch this though, because in just a few seconds, you can take it <laughs> and you can repair it. I mean, Is it's that part? quick. And, well, and I mean, not, so you don't have to right. wait. It's not worth taking to a jeweler when it's no. just basically a fashion piece of jewelry. Or it might be a very expensive fashion piece of jewelry, right. and you want to continue to be able to wear it. Yeah. That's a great idea. I mean, even for dumb things like this, like these little things on the end of the shoes, you know what these are called? It's an aglet. An aglet? I know, it's called an aglet. Is it real? Yeah, it's called an aglet. So what I did was I took some laser bond, and actually I could probably put a little bit more in here. Just put it on the end of this, even, or like a drawstring inside clothing or something yeah, like that, yeah. if it starts to fray, and just hit it with this, and it's actually gonna make an aglet on the end of it. It's that's gonna harden. That's a great idea, because it'll stop it from fraying. It'll stop it from fraying. Look, at that's already hardened right there, huh. so I can use that, I can thread it through things. It, it makes well, it so much easier Well, you know when you have a lot of camping with. gear, if you think camping, hiking gear, yep. there's always a lot of cords and stuff that you want to keep pristine, yes. and those are the, the ones that get beat up really quickly. You can kind of repair them, because that gear's very expensive. Oh, yeah. When no. you really think about it. All right, here's a quick update. Almost a thousand now ordered. Remember, you're getting a set of two, and you also get the little case to go with it. I just like putting it in the drawer in the kitchen. I know exactly where it is, and when one of those oohs happens around my house, I just go, go get it. I was even demoing it for my friend Robin. I'm like, you gotta <laughs> see how this works. Because again, you know, you've got these projects. Maybe it is that wonderful keepsake that your grandma gave you mm -hmm. when you were little, and you accidentally, you're trying to dust, you knocked it over, and you're crushed. You're like, oh my gosh, how do I fix this? Right. And because it's clear, and it's fast, and it's quick, and it stays, you can really kind of bring it back to life you know, instead of having something broken, and you don't what to do with exactly, it. Exactly, you know? yeah. Like, who can fix that? Yeah, and, and the nice thing, you know, my favorite thing, it doesn't dry in the air, and I love that. Which is really nice. Yeah, yeah you, have a you waste a lot of glue. Until otherwise. you use the light, it stays loose. Yep, it does. <laughs> I like that. It does. All right, we're going to wrap up on this. Almost a 1,000 now ordered. Stay right there. Take advantage of the flex and, of course, the free shipping on this, too, right? Yep, we got them both. Thanks, Lou. Well, Lou's not going for I'm not going anywhere. We've got the flashlights coming up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let me tell you what's coming up at midnight. Yeah. Isn't this cool? It's a brand new hoodie, and we're so thrilled because Jimmy Fallon, along with the amazing Carl Banks, who's the president of G3, and of course, Giants football great, uh, have created this together. Jimmy came up with the idea, and Carl said, yeah, let's go with it. We are launching tonight at midnight, and it's gonna be so much fun, and it's such a neat idea. It's called Hands High. We have the exclusivity to the zip-up hoodie. You will not be able to get this in any retail outlet whatsoever. So when when you cheer, when you throw your hands up, whether you're happy or you're angry, when you're waving at someone down the street, they're gonna be able to see that you're a big fan. And it's an awesome, beautiful hoodie. The quality's amazing, of course, because it's from G3. You're gonna love Flex, the price, everything. We've got a special deal coming up at midnight for all of our NFL goodies, and we've got a really cool show. In fact, just so you'll know, we have our first Micro Rochelle throw coming up, blanket, actually. And we know you're a collector if you're gonna watch the show, so we have a brand new one for you in just a little bit, but Lou has not gone anywhere. I mistakenly said goodbye to him, but he's back. <laughs> and that's a good thing. And yeah. you know, Lou, there's a lot going on right now. And I think, unfortunately, what's happening is kind of a sober reminder that yeah. we always should be prepared, yep. no matter what happens. And this is such a great item for that, but also for every day. Now, the AR, and the most amazing thing about these is you're getting four in the set and, and individually boxed in the color that matches the lights, because you oh, get nice. four different color lights in this, oh, which is really cool. Now, real quick, just to give you the overview on these guys, there's 23 LEDs on this. The LEDs in the front, the 20 that are up here are SMD LEDs, surface mount device LEDs, which means, of course, lots and lots of light, very little heat, very little power draw on the battery. So these are gonna last a very long time. If I press the button on the front one time, all those LEDs come on, they put out a ton of light. If I press it again, there's a flashlight on the front. So these are actually, the flashlight on the front is gonna throw farther, this one is more of a floodlight, okay? Um, on the back of this, you have a built-in hook, which comes out and reverses around 360 degrees. There's a magnet in the bottom, mm. and wow. you can position this. Oh, this thing's loaded. That's clever, this yeah. thing is loaded. You can position the light anywhere you need it, um, and it's all rubberized all the way around, so they feel great to the touch. That's brilliant. Yeah, aren't they smart? And I like them because they're compact. They're a nice, small, little size. Very tiny little guys uh, th that you're going to get with these. And if you notice right here, we've got them stuck to this toolbox yeah. because they are, you know, because they do have magnets in the bottom, and you can see the way they're just stuck to every everything on here. So you're going to get a ton of light on these. They're going to be hands-free uh, operation with them because you don't have to keep them, you know, in your hands or like most people do a flashlight in the mouth or under the armpit. Or the armpit. You don't have to do any of that. Yeah. <laughs> and just look at the light that comes off of these. That's the flashlight feature on the front right there. But once you get to where you're working, you can either use that or you can put those floodlights on. I mean, it's I like think if you're trying to work inside a car, you know, or any dark oh, yeah. space. Also, if you just want to hang this, and I love the video of the closet. Yeah. You know, I've got old closets have absolutely no light inside them whatsoever. I have a really old house. Mm -hmm. Just so clever. You put it in the closet and boom, you've got 
that light, you turn it on, turn it off. Also, again, I'm totally into glamping. So I always think <laughs> about camp tents, yep. you know, and you never have enough light and you just, it's there. You hang it on the top of the tent and it kind of floods your yeah. tent. Well, it's, and it's so much safer than candles, you know, for blackouts or any situation like that. Uh, these are the, you know, you can give these to the kids. I, actually, somebody the other day here at HSN told me they bought a set of these and the, the kids use these as the night lights in their bedrooms. Oh, is Which is a really cool idea. But notice that hook turns 360 degrees. So if you did want to hang this in a closet, you could absolutely do that. Now, what I'd like to do is let's bring the lights down to the studio because I want everybody to see how bright these are. I'm going to turn these guys on, Suzanne. Get ready because it's going to blind you. I'm telling you. And it's just like, thanks, Lou. It's a, it's a ton of light that Ooh, comes off. Oh, I do off like of the light it, it produces. Yeah, it's, a, it's a really nice, like, low. Look at this. Look how flattering that is, too. That's, and there's four, there's two of them at me. Two on you, and I got three on me over here. But, you know, it's bright. because we have TV cameras here with the big lenses on them, it takes a lot of light. Well, look, and this is crazy. Show I literally, if you even let's say, you know, you've lost electricity, yep. it's you want something, you literally could play cards with this. You could literally oh, yeah. read a book with this. Like, can you see, guys? You can literally read all my notes on my card clearly. Yeah. That's a lot of light. Yeah. There's a ton of light. And it's a, it's those SMD LEDs that are inside of these. It's the absolute latest technology. I mean, these are made by Bell and Hell. They've been around for 109 years. And we all remember them from when we were kids for making projectors. <laughs> well, what's one of the key components to projectors? Bulbs. So they know how to make really, really good really powerful bulbs and notice all the features in these you wouldn't expect all of these in something like this yeah I'll turn these off so they don't blind I you like, I was like Lou I need to see for the next couple of hours they are really oh you're gonna see was, lots of dots I was kind of yeah I was kind of skeptical because they're about the size of a deck of cards yeah so I thought oh sure they're gonna give you a little light which is nice they give you a lot of light and you get a set of four and as Lou said too individually boxed so think stocking gifts it's never too early when I see something really clever and I I go, you know, that would make a great gift for the guy in my life, my son for in his car, you know, all those kind of things. I get them when I see them because yeah. you just never know when we're going to get them back. So you have four little stocking gifts or four little gifts to give if you're having, you know, I don't know, whatever, a little party or, you know, just four places that you want more light. You've got it. But I think tonight, especially in the next couple of days, there's nothing worse than being in a state where you don't have power and everybody's scrambling to find that one flashlight you had in the house and you go, oh, really, who took the batteries out of this right when we need it? We know candles are dangerous and you don't want to leave those alone. And there's nothing worse than if something's going on that's crazy outside with the weather. Mm -hmm. It could be ice, it could be snow, it could be a storm, whatever. There's nothing worse than not feeling secure and not having light. Oh yeah, no, light absolutely. Light makes everything feel better. It does. It it's does. a primal thing with, you know, us as human beings, we have to have that light. We need heat, we need fire. We need to have that light. Now, this right here, on a kid's backpack, because it has a right, hook on top, it. you know, kids are getting out there at the bus stop at 5.30 in the morning now, it's pitch black outside. Wouldn't you feel better knowing that they've got something like that just hanging on the back of the backpack? But what if you're just not walking the dog late at night? Okay, you wanna That's see my dog walking trick? Yeah, yeah. Okay, watch this, because I, I live on a street with no street lights, okay? So here's what I do. I'm gonna step out to the side of the table over here just have to show you that street yet <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> but take a so look at old dirt road <laughs> yeah, look what i do i just hang it because i have two dogs and they're doing this usually they're going idea. all over the place so i just have one hanging i mean i actually have lights on their collars too oh smart. but for me i want people to see me too not just right. the dogs right. so i have this you know hands-free operation right here that's a beautiful thing now while i'm standing here if i take this off watch this you can use this on any flat surface it doesn't have to be a magnetic surface i mean a, a piece of metal for the magnet because it balances that's so i can great. aim that light wherever i so if I'm working you know, under the sink, what, crafting? I know what I you're going to say. I was going to say, yes, you can read my mind. You know what? My sewing machine, my finger, yeah. I have an older unit. It only has one bulb. Mm -hmm. And now the singers have like 20 bulbs underneath it. But if you only have one, especially as you get a little older, it gets really hard to see. What, yeah, not that I am, but you know. Anyway, it actually gets hard to see. Uh, yep. So this would be so perfect even just to position it in, in the in the, in the the hole of my sewing machine to be able to see what oh, I'm yeah, sewing better. Yeah. Or any projects you're doing. That threading a needle. I mean, yeah. you know, when you're... Anything yeah. where you're working, to like, okay, before we were working with the laser bond, okay, and I was trying to do the jewelry up close, if I'd had that light on there, I think that would have been a little bit easier. And all I had to do is just take in a position it right on the table and put that light there. And remember, I can use the floodlight feature or I can use the flashlight feature on the front of this as well. And you can see, that's a very bright light. So you can position that. And look at this. Even with our crazy bright studio lights, look how bright that is on my hand from that flashlight. And if I do the floodlights, look at that. The whole hand's lit up now. 
So there's a lot of light coming from these. You know what? I want to look inside that box right there just to see sure. if we have, yeah, if the other boxes, they Can are. Can I your question, okay. though? Oh, Watch good. This. And you get all four colors you in the set. You get all four colors in the set. They come in a big box like this, but then you get individual gift boxes inside. So you could give, this is four amazing gifts right here. I mean, you know what? It's uh, The price is like $1.90 each or something. Yeah. $1.95 or something. We're at like $19.95 divided by four. Oh, by four. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> What kind of math am I doing? That's like, wow, Lou. <laughs> uh, not quite that price. Not but darn, quite darn that close, good. But darn good. close. Yeah, it's not on sale. Um, but here's the thing. We also have two flex on this. And again, I just think, you know, I think whether you're in the car, I think winter nights oh, when yeah. you're in you're in the mall and you have one of these in your purse and you have to walk out when the mall's closed during the holiday season and it's dark and it's creepy out, yeah. it's just nice to have a little flashlight. And I like it, ladies especially, because it is so portable. Look, it's about the size of a deck of cards. So how many of us dig in our purse and we can't find something? Or I'll be honest with you, you're in a restaurant and you can't read, when are we talking about these old stuff, right? I'm like, <laughs> somehow you can't read the menu because it's too dark in the restaurant. This is a really kind of discreet way to pull it out and really get yeah. be able to see. I mean, there's nothing more frustrating than getting the restaurant bill yeah. and going, mm, I wonder how much it is. Because that, <laughs> that, that faded, you know how faded right. the, the receipts right. are? It's like, hmm. I'll, I'll give my wife the receipt and I'll go like, what should I tip on this? And she'll look at me and goes like, you don't know how much it is, do you? And I'm like, you can't see that. <laughs> Maybe not. And, and again, all you need is a little extra light. Just a little more it. light. Well, and here's the thing, okay? A lot of us have these lanterns, okay? And they have their place. They throw a nice circle of light. But let's say there's four people. You're sitting around the lantern, and one of the four folks says, I've got to go use the restroom. Maybe you're in a blackout, okay? Who's getting the lantern? The person going to the restroom or the people that are staying put? You know, with our lights, because you're getting four of these, everybody has a light. Well, think about this when you're in a car hmm. on a long trip with the kids. Yeah. The kids are in the back seat, and you've got one who loves to read, or they need to do their homework. And let's say it's in the evening, but they love to read, and it's at night. Wouldn't this be smart? You could literally give it to them, and they could place it, and literally they could read their book oh, yeah. while you're on a long trip, even at night. Yeah. I think that there's so many really clever right. ways to use it. And this. see, here's the thing. Because this has the hook, because it has the magnet, because it has the stand, you can use this ways you could never use a regular flashlight. Never. I mean, we're just giving you a couple of ideas here in this video of things, map lights. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, you know, you you know, if, if your car breaks down, you could attach it to the side of the car to let oncoming traffic know yeah. that you're working on something or it'll hold the light there. It's better than having somebody else stand out on the road with you, have it hold the light down there for you. So many uses. I always carry one in my toolbox. I've got one in all of our vehicles, right. you know, because at this price, you're getting four. It's just you know, yeah, it just makes sense. It's easy. And it means the world to everybody when you need light. Yeah. It is. It's it's never, uh, it was it was interesting the other night, I was at home, and during the first round of bad storms we had a couple of weeks ago, uh, we lost our power, and we lost it for a pretty good amount of time. And then I was really happy because I had my Bell and Howe mm -hmm. in the drawer, and I still had to come to work. We had power here, not at my house. So I remember I took it on Facebook, I had my Bell, Bell and Howe oh, in the bathroom, I do. and I was putting my contacts in with it, and literally I was running around going, I still got to go. I can't can't stay and wait for the lights to come on. Right. And I just had this great sense of relief that I knew right when I needed it, it was there. That made a big difference. Yeah. It wasn't like who pulled the batteries out of this, daggone it, or is this working, or it dies super fast, or you have to use expensive batteries. These just barely sip battery power. Yeah. So you know when you go to pull them out of the drawer, they're gonna work. Yeah, and that's the nice thing too, is that you know that if you've got four and you give one to one kid, one to the other, maybe hubby takes one, you know you got one that you put in a drawer and it's still there. Right. Because they got their own. That's right. Yeah. You know, what I mean? and that's, and, and that's a, the way I do things my house it's like you got yours i got mine so we we, we both know where it's all are. good <laughs> it's all good you know um you know but that's the thing is you're getting for and i love what was going on right there the little boy was sitting there reading by one of these as you pointed out at the beginning of the presentation you yeah. can actually sit there and read by these because they are there bright one more time real quick just to go over the features has the stand has the magnet on the bottom, rubberized feel all the way around. Press the button one time, you get the 20 uh, SMD LEDs that light up. Press it again, you get the flashlight feature right there, and you've got that hook in the back that comes out and swivels 360 degrees mm -hmm. all the way around. It's like get everything you need. And you get a set of four, and they're individually boxed. So if yes. you're gonna tick, tuck, you know, tuck them in little you know, stocking gifts, you're good to go. All right, Lou, now I'm gonna let you go. Okay. <laughs> okay, put your hands up, ready? Touchdown, woo! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get one of these on. Well, I didn't say anything. <laughs> Stay tuned, we have another great item coming up. 
I'm Adam Freeman. Join me and Amy Morrison for First Friday, your first look at the best of the month ahead on HSN. We have exclusive sneak peeks at what's to come in October. Be the first to check out all the new launches, latest products, and best deals. Plus, you never know what we'll do, so join the fun, break out the bubbly, and watch Friday at 7 p.m. Go to hsn.com and search First Friday for more. It's HSN's Columbus Day Sale. Enjoy four days of flex pay and special pricing on some of your favorite brands, like Diane Gilman, Taya Beauty, and Wolfgang Puck. Don't miss other exclusive offers, like free shipping on all NFL, free shipping and four flex pay on select fall fashion staples, and up to 20% off five flex pay and free shipping on select mattresses. HSN's Columbus Day Sale starts tonight at midnight, only on HSN. DG2 is comfort, stretch, style. That bootcut classic was the first jean I designed. The super stretch is a technological revolution. I love the Ponte jean. It makes you look so thin. That comfort waist is going to overtake the world of denim. Once you have that perfect fitting jean, wait and see how life changing it is. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. Join us as we celebrate the 20th anniversary of Andrew Lessman with special pricing and free shipping. And it's all available now at hsn.com. Cooking is my life. Mm. Cooking at home for my family is a special time. So I want everybody out there to have a great time in the kitchen while they're cooking. And the most important thing is to have the right appliances and the right pots and pans. I give it to all my chefs in the restaurant and they give me suggestions and they try them out. And so can you at home. Was the night before host pick and all through the home, our hosts were all stirring, but they weren't alone. To make holidays more special than ever this year, they invited their families to share the good cheer. The hosts have all made their picks with care. From gatherings to gifts, they'll help you prepare. It's a three-day event, and to make spirits bright, get four flex pay on all, and to all a good night. that emergencies happen and we definitely want to be prepared for it. I mean, there's just no doubt about that, right? And unfortunately, it's kind of a sobering thought and, and, and you know, yeah, it's, a, it's a reality. You know, we've got to be ready. And much like we were talking about the torchlight, you know, having that light, one of the crucial things to have, especially in an emergency, is to have food and really good food. Uh, well, we have Wise Company here tonight and we've got a really important configuration that they have put together in case we do have that emergency, you know? Um, and we consider that whether it's a weather emergency or it might be a life emergency. I know people have picked this up and fortunately to have it, they happened to lose their job and they said, hey, you know what? I can still eat and I can still feed my family. I actually bought it for my son. Um, he went away to college and I was like, hey, you're not a very good cook and if you want good food, here's the way to be able to make it very easily. So I sent it to him. Uh, this is from the Wise Food Company and they are one of the very, very best in long-term food preparation. This is our emergency meal preparedness kit. It is a 140 servings and what I truly love about it and why I sent it to my son was it covers everything breakfast lunch dinner even some snacks in between and with this it normally is $238.38 we have it at an introductory price of $119.95 and tonight is it three flex pays yep we have three flex pays and we've included free shipping on this as well so we're gonna talk to Stephanie Roberts who brings us the wise products hi Steph hello hello, and hello. this is something that is so important because no matter what happens in the world you have to eat. So what WISE does is it enables us to have 
great tasting emergency food where all we do is add water. And I know you hear that great tasting part and you're like, all right, yeah, emergency mm -hmm. food. Uh, no, not usually good. But this is the difference with the Wise Company is the way these products are made and as a result, the way they taste. I wanna show you what happens in the factory because to start with, these are chef-inspired recipes. So the chefs are putting them together. These are real ingredients. The flavor blend is there. The spicing is there. So they taste great. But the second thing that happens is really important for the emergency part because the bottom line is emergencies obviously aren't something we plan on so we don't know when we're going to need it. What WISE does is with special atmospheric packaging they've created a pouch that seals out humidity and it seals out oxygen. So in here your food stays fresh no matter what because of their state-of-the-art technology for up to 25 years. So when it comes time to preparing for planning to make Make sure that no matter what is happening, be it a hurricane, be it a winter storm, be it a wildfire, because no matter where you are in the country, at least in terms of Mother Nature, something can always happen. With this, for 25 years, you know you will eat. And it doesn't get any simpler than just adding water. And that's the other thing that is so great about this. All you do is have to have water that's safe to drink and you're good to go. Now you're gonna notice that we have this sitting on a burner. I wanna point out, you do not need hot water. Makes it quicker. Mm -hmm. Most food tastes better when it's hot too, I'm not gonna lie. But in an emergency situation, you will be perfectly happy to be able to use tap water, cold water, any kind of water that is safe to drink. You add the water, you stir it up, you let it sit, it reconstitutes itself, and then you are good to go. Outside of the emergency scenario, think about it. Campers, oh, great. hiking, Campers. hunting, Mine tailgating. Was my, mine was for my son to eat. Uh, college kids who can't cook. College kids who can't cook. I was like, here you go, here's some wise. I really was. Um, but I think tonight, too, you know, it's a sobering thought. And again, when you're in a state of emergency, there's nothing worse than not being prepared. I mean, we live in Florida, and they always are talking about being ready. And that's true for everybody, whether it's snow or ice or thunderstorms or whatever it might be. And having this for me, because we have this at home as well, is my security blanket. I hope I never have to open a package. I hope I never have to do it, but I feel secure knowing that in an emergency, we will be able to eat. And if you're really hungry, it just makes every situation even worse, you know, and more desperate, and quite quite frankly. I love it, though, because WISE also believes in giving back as a part of really being prepared for emergencies. Absolutely. I want you to explain that, because I think it's so important for people to understand. Well, first of all, WISE is a U.S. company, so I like the fact that they are here in the United States, and they're worried about the people that are impacted by the many disasters, over 100,000 pouches, so meals, food, sustenance has been given to tornado victims, because we know so often those are very unpredictable as they occur across our country. Uh, I spoke to the great people at WISE already this evening. They're working with the state of Florida right now to get some food for the millions that may be impacted by this massive hurricane, Matthew. So the company is full of people who understand. Our goal is to keep our family safe. That's what you want, that's what I want, and that's why this company exists. There are so many unpredictable things in the world. Maybe it's just a basic power outage. You know, you forget mm -hmm. that, you know, something like a car accident can take out a transformer and suddenly you don't have power in your home for two days. So therefore, this feeds your family. It doesn't matter what the reason is. What matters is that you're ready. And when it comes right down to it, readiness is the peace of mind. Right. Now, um, um, how many servings does this do in family? Will it feed for how long? Yep. And then also talk about the food that's in here. We're going to talk about the meals. It's really good. <laughs> Absolutely. And I'm actually going to eat some. I will eat to prove it to you. It's very delicious. And I've got a couple of new things for you to try oh, as good. well. I think okay. you'll be pleasantly surprised. So this is our 140 serving grab and go bucket. I got to tell you, I love the bucket. Okay. I love the fact that if I need to do something like evacuate or change locations, I can take my food with me. That's one and you less know thing I have to right worry there. about. It's, it's right not there. like you're trying to buy grab a bunch of cans and a bunch of rice bags. Exactly. You literally just pick up the bucket and you go. And, and how much is all that way? camping, amazing. Plop it so in the easy. trunk, plop it in the RV, yep. and you are good to go. So 140 servings is enough food to feed one person for one week, or, a, or rather one person for one month, and the family of wow. four for a week. So this is a lot of food. We're Wait, talking repeat that. It's 
one, one person, person for a full one month. month. And, family and of guys, four, one week, or it goes down to two people for two weeks. So judge it by your but, family but size. Look at the, I mean, look, it's this tub is this size. And so it's not, it's not like you have huge boxes sitting around your closet. That's the other thing. Yeah. People say, well, I don't have room to put this anywhere. Look, this, if you're by yourself, that is one full month of food. And it's in this very nice compact compartment. That's exactly. Brilliant. Now That's let's great. talk about the flavors because again, I know you say emergency food, you think bland yeah. and tasteless and this isn't <laughs> gonna be good. Look at these entrees and Suzanne will be eating them to show you how great <laughs> they are. We have the noodle soup, the beef stroganoff, the chicken pot pie, the cheesy mac is one That's of the new. new ones. So I definitely want Ooh, you I'm to give this a try. This it is great and I'll tell you what, you know that mac and cheese that comes in the blue box? Yeah. This is nothing like that. No this kidding. tastes like mom and grandma made it I'm on the so stove themselves. This. this is the creamy vegetable mm. rotini. Oh my gosh, it's really good. Tell me about the that. flavor. Delicious, very satisfying, very flavorful. Mm -hmm. Most That's of what mac I thought. and cheese doesn't have much flavor. The to blue it. box kind does not mm -hmm. have it's much flavor. Bland. No, this yeah. tastes like homemade mac and cheese mm. to me. So I like the flavor good. profiles wow. that really are with all the recipes. Wait, so what was this one? I'm sorry. That one in front of you. You're going to need to try that one too. This one's actually <laughs> my favorite. This is the creamy vegetable rotini. Mm. But you can see the big peas, the big carrots. I mean, this That's is real really stuff here. It's not you know food that's made to taste like it's chicken or made to taste like it's a vegetable. Right. It is the actual real deal. Here, I'll trade you. Oh, thank you, dear. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so there's 10 oh, different eat. lunch and dinner entrees, such as the creamy pasta rotini, the teriyaki rice, the beef stroganoff, the tortilla soup, the rice pilaf. Mm, that's so really good. 10 different things that you can eat, say, for your main meals. And you notice they're all sort of comfort foods, foods that really are going to provide you some sustenance. And hearty. Hearty. They'll mm -hmm. stick with you. Mm -hmm. And then there's three different grains, a brown sugar oatmeal, an apple cinnamon oatmeal, and strawberry granola. Correct. Isn't that amazing? So I love all, all that. that chocolate pudding exclusive to HSN because you know what if I'm gonna have stress with my family that I better have some chocolate yeah. that's kind of the way that breaks down and then the ability to make uh, whey milk and orange drink and I really like cool? the whey milk too because you know it, when you get to that emergency situation when grocery store shelves start to get bare and things like that mm -hmm. milk is something that's hard to get and for a lot of kids milk is a comfort thing right. it's part of a routine so this is just kind of a way that you can feed your family you can have the peace of mind you can sit down at the table and have a routine even in a stressful situation, even in a and power outage. And to your point, Stephanie, you, you just buy it once and then don't forget it. You forget about it. You 25 know, you, years. Yeah, you don't even have to think about it. You know, it's just there. But the moment you need it is the moment you go, thank God goodness, mm -hmm. I thought about it. And you know, don't let another, you know, week or month or another season go by, especially as we head towards the winter, when we hear a lot about ice storms that take out a lot of power. Just know, hey, you know what? I got it done. And you'll never have to think about it again. Exactly. And there's a season for everything. You know, I mean, I know we're talking about this as Florida and the Southeast are looking at still the continuation of hurricane season. Mm -hmm. But next comes winter storm season. And in terms of power outages, that's where you start to see some of the really widespread issues. You know, the heavy snows, the ice but it doesn't matter where you live it's always a season something. for something whether it's mother nature I liked your point about economics you know if you're in a position now where you can have this and put some food away because God forbid you're ever in a position where it isn't so easy you know, if, if the emergency is that you're a tired mom and you have two little kids and you're not feeling well and you can't get to the grocery store, guess what? This is a meal that you will be able to rip open and put on the table for your family to have that peace of mind, knowing that you can always get through whatever's coming your way just in a basic day. You I'm know, sure. there's so many advantages. You just add water. The taste is amazing. And when you do the math for the price it is today versus the amount of servings, it's less than a dollar a serving. <laughs> So Crazy. less than a dollar a serving for food that tastes great and you'll have for up to 25 years. You know, you look at it like car insurance, you have home yep. insurance, yep. you have medical insurance. Look at this as food insurance. And we wouldn't be without it. We really, I mean, we mm -hmm. have it. We have it at home and it's, again, we put it away. I never think about it and I never have to think about it. Exactly. You know, I don't have to worry about, oh my gosh, it's getting some bad weather. Oh, I better go to the store and stock up. I, I'm not one of those people who have to do that, fortunately, because I have the wise food system. You know what happens? Everybody goes, oh, I'm going to go to the store. I got to buy all this stuff. I got to stock up. I'm one of the families we don't have to worry about it because I know I've got food ready to go. It's not my top concern. My top concern is everybody's safe, you know, that kind of thing. So I can worry about something else. But that's a huge one I can check off my list 
every single day. I never have to worry about that because I know we've got it in our closet. Here's what we're doing now. The introductory price is for a short amount of time. That's kind of important to understand. It will go up to the full price, which is $149, which still is a really nice savings off the retail for how large a serving size this is. So if you'd like to take advantage of it, you can use that now. We also have free shipping. That's another $12 you're saving because you happen to be shopping with us tonight. And then we have three flex pays, and that's easy. We accept all major credit cards and PayPal, and you have three months to pay this off. Um, and I, well, I suggest you get at home and try some of it. Absolutely. That's what everybody does, and then once you try it, it quickly becomes a customer pick because it is good food. You know, it's not bland. The kids don't go, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna touch that, I'm not gonna eat that. You like, don't this know. mac and cheese, I'm all over this. They this will is good. never know. Good, I'm glad never you like know. the mac and cheese. Never and here's know. the thing That's that right. has really struck me. This is a customer pick, yet it's emergency food. Mm -hmm. So that tells me that our customers are getting this home and they are trying it. And I encourage you to get it home. Don't tell your family that it is emergency food, mm -hmm. that it is from a pouch. Because when you put this on the table, they are never going to know because the texture is that great, the taste is that great, the balance of flavor is that great. And then you can say to them, not only is this great food that I have brought home for you, but we will have it for up to 25 years and isn't that a great decision for our people? of mine. Sure, absolutely. Okay, now we also have accessories to go with it. We've got the fruit and sauces kit, and we have the flavored meats protein kit with the rice. Right. So let's explain those, because you could add this to it. I like all of these, because these are a great way to have fresh fruit on hand at any time. The fruit kit includes strawberries, bananas, apples, and my favorite, peaches. Also comes with vanilla pudding, and these aren't just things that look and smell like fruit. These are actual strawberries, actual bananas, and they are packaged with that special wise state-of-the-art technology for up to 25 years, grab and go fruit. Amazing concept if you're into hiking and camping and being mm -hmm. out of doors, because mm -hmm. it's great to be able to bring that with you. I like the protein, it's a variety of beef and chicken, also sauces, and it comes with rice. These actually can be standalone meals, the way they're put together, you see here, but it's a great way if you have a bigger family to stretch the size of the meals. These are already hearty servings, but if you're feeding six people, you can do that with one pouch when you add a little extra meat, because protein fills you up. And, and then the veggie, vegetable right? kit, the green beans, the broccoli, the peas, and the corn. You can either eat these as they are. They're very snackable. And I got to tell you, a great carbohydrate if you're, again, hiking or doing things like that outside, help keep you warm. But you can also reconstitute those in water. So these are all things that you can add on to the 140 serving meals. And again, I just want to repeat, there's a, one of these, one container is going to feed one person for up to a month. You know, if you have two people, obviously it's two weeks, four people, it's for a week. That is a huge big deal when the container's really surprisingly small. Absolutely. The <laughs> container is compact. You can see all the different pouches that will come in it. So it, I like the container. It is waterproof. It is bug proof. Bug -proof. Yeah. It is grab and go ready whenever you would need it. Honestly, I've taken these out of the container, put them in an under the bed box mm -hmm. in my room, just because that's where I had the storage space. And I've got the container now if I need it for anything else, such as water. So there's a lot of different things you can do, but this just kind of checks a big concern off your list of worries in life. You and know? you said this earlier too, unfortunately it's a sober reminder of what's going on right now. You know? yep. It's not something we ever want to use, but boy, you do think about it now. Because no matter where you are, something storm-wise, economic-wise, instability-wise can happen. So I feel better knowing that no matter what does happen, I've got the food there. Because there's going to be plenty of other things to worry about. You're going to worry about, is your family doing okay? If you've got kids, are they scared? You know, the pets, the property. There's enough other things to worry about in life that we can't control, that we can't necessarily prepare for. This one, this one you can control. You can have the food. You will have it for 25 years. And give it a try, because everybody that's given it a try has made this a customer pick. And it's one of the most important things you need need and one of the least things you can now worry about. How cool is Good that? Good way to put it. Again, you know, you don't have to like stand in line or get go out and go, oh, I got to get all this stuff. You just don't even, that's something you just check off your list as you're getting prepared for even the winter season. And you know, if you live up north, a lot of times it's electricity, it's ice, it's power, uh, it's whatever. Uh, and like I said, if you got a college kid who can't cook, it's a great idea actually. <laughs> he loves it. Well, or an older person that doesn't want to go out once that's we true. start to get in a, into cold point. weather, there's a lot, there's a lot of different things and factors that come into play. I look at it like this. We sell so many things here that I, 
love to buy, that I enjoy shopping, that I really kind of want. This is one of those things that we sell that I can say we honestly need. Every single one of us needs to eat no matter what. So this takes the concern as you go throughout life of will you be able to feed your family? It's a huge worry off the list. All right, Mr. Bay, I'm gonna wrap it up with you. Thanks for joining us. Good to see you. All right, and so now we're gonna wrap this up and coming up next, it's one of my favorite, favorite times of the year. It's football season. Yay! Yay. Who's your favorite team? Uh, I'm a Bears girl. A Bears, there you and go. They're not Chicago having a good Bears. year. No, they're not, unfortunately. <laughs> but we're gonna have a good night tonight. Coming up at midnight, in fact, right now, we are gonna launch our very best value of the day. Thank you, Jimmy Fallon. Thank you, G3. We're gonna get start with an exclusive hoodie and it begins right this very moment. It's called Hands High. I'm the biggest Jets fan. I'm the biggest Broncos fan. I'm the biggest Bears fan. Oh yeah? We'll see who's the real biggest fan. I got some big news. Yeah. Mm. I'm a grandfather. Hey! Mm. You up?